Ball one, a bit on the leg stump line. Then will be runs here. South Africa open their account, probably with an extra. We'll wait for umpire Fessel to give his uh, official signal. Just nicely worked away. It was on the toes, very full on the leg stump line. A lot of wrist work, and Tasman won't spare that. Big boundary square of the wicket, so they come back for three on that occasion. Nicely punched off the back foot. It runs here. This outfield is now quick. Looks faster than the T20s. First boundary of the ODIs. Again, have a look at that. This time through covers. Nicely struck down the ground. Probably didn't time it as well as she did in the previous over. Shorter length, pulled away just over mid wicket. Might not go to the boundary. The chase is on. The ball just reaches there. Yeah, it does. Bit of width, smashed away. And it will beat sweeper cover as well. Down the wicket. No chance of catch it there. on the leg stump now there's going to be a long chase because there's no fine leg square leg is giving the chase and so it short third if they run quick they can get four but they'll settle with three on that occasion has regrouped and looking good <laughs> and he's spinning down oh he's giving him out he's giving it out straight away rashid riaz didn't wait whatsoever clearly wasn't impressed tasman brits <laughs> arm delivery and it, she gave an impression it looked her pretty high this time wait and she's dragged it from outside off oh, that's a shot and given she would feel that she's missed out on a major opportunity Wolfhard. it was short it was there to be hit but she couldn't clear that fielder short mid wicket what a big wicket it was short it was there for the taking but she found the fielder Nashra Sandhu very very smart catch Moving to her right, remember she's a left-hander. Wolfhart going for 17 after looking very, very good. Uh, beats the fielder. You just get a feeling, could have done a better job trying to cut that off in the circle. That well, was very close. Now, there's a lot of run. It is a third who has to give that chase. The ball is just rolling to the rope and it will win it. Yeah, absolutely. Those were two very important wickets. Uh, nicely played in the gap and it's gone for a boundary. Oh, that's a big one. Really big one. Straight down the ground. To see her bowling. Edged, edged. Appeal, yes, given. That is a beautiful start by Ali Riaz. She's not happy. And rightly so. Well pitched up ball. Uh, driving away from the body. Yeah, obviously the batter are not happy. Meanwhile, uh, this delivery is uh, played uh, towards the mid-wicket boundary for a nice-looking uh, boundary. Oh, sweetly timed and beautifully placed by Cap. Just got a tickle to it. Long chase. Fielder at short third. We'll get the ball inside the fence. Fielder play. Bisma Maruf, huge. In the uh, that short cover fielder was in the game. Nida Dar, with the outstretched hand. Nida Dar was in the action. Nice flighted delivery, and couldn't control the drive. Oh, and Javeria Khan as well. This has been timed beautifully. Oh, very very late, very deft touch. Chase is on. Bisma Maruf has done exceedingly well. Gotcha. Using the long handle straight away. First ball goes for a boundary. Pressure on the bowler. And did it in some style. That force behind it and the placement also. Ooh. Was there an inside edge? I just feel I heard something on the inside part of the bat. It hasn't collected it, so have a look. Nicely swept, nicely swept in the gap. 
Well kept. Yeah, which given. And with that single, Sinelis will get her 14th ODI 50. Great knock by her of 65 deliveries. She's done well. Came in the time and they lost their captain and her partner. And she's uh, played an innings and still going on with it. One with the responsibility of taking the side to a good score. Good looking shot. Good timing on that again. Very, oh, she did well, Diana. But the ball just slips through for a boundary. That was hit hard. Once again, Sidra Nawaz brilliant behind the stumps. Look at that back foot. It did shift, but did it get back in ground in time? See, both the feet in the air at the moment. Almost, oh, closer than we all thought. This is what good wicket keeping can do. Oh, she got in, but not by much. Splendid work. With the tide, she's just hit it in the air and in the gap. Through the gap. It was aerial for a brief moment. There was shouts of catch it. Helped it on its way. Another boundary. That will bring up the 50 for Marizan Cap. 12th 50. 50 in ODI cricket and a very, very timely one for South Africa. Well played, Marizan Cap. Beautifully played, just threaded it through. Been dispatched. Sweep, it's in the gap. It won't go to the fence. Oh, almost dead. Strong blow over the fielder's head inside the ring, and that will run away. There's a square leg and mid-wicket in place for Gulam Fatma. Flatter one and dealt with some power. She's got her work to do, but she won't be able to chase it down. That's another boundary. Breaking it away from the better. And again, it was a good delivery. Oh my God, that went towards a boundary. Optional job. Got it towards third. They should look to get three at least because it's a long boundary, a long chase. Yeah, they're coming back for three easy. And it should have been taken and this can be an appeal. As she comes down the track and over the head. Fantastic batting. Just stay in and we're back live. Up and over again. Over Ali Ariel's head. She's doing the chase but she might not be able to get to that. Oh, that is fantastic. Such force behind that shot and the placement also. Oh, that's gone through. Off the back foot, brilliantly done by Cap. Well, there it is. 100 for Cap. The second ODI 100 for her and second time against Pakistan. Scored 100 against Pakistan at the World Cup. And here again at the National Bank Cricket Stadium in Karachi, he scores a big hundred. What a strong comeback from the side. And that won't be easy. Stoppage that is an opportunity too late to come and eventually she's managed to take the catch. For a moment I thought that she's a little slow in taking off but Omehani pulls it off in the end. Spectacular catch. What a catch. It needed something special to break this partnership. And that is what we got. She's in cap. Gone for 100. In this series, if it comes about. Nicely done. Wrist works. And Elise gets her first ODI 100. And a, what a moment to get that hard fought 100 here. Coming back strongly as a team and as an individual after that whitewash in the T20s. Showing class, showing determination, and showing what she's made of. Big moment for her. She'll remember this for a long time. A first hundred is always very, very special. Definitely, for sure. That's a bad ball. Fine leg up in the circle, full toss on the legs. That's a good stop. Brilliant stop there. Surely saving a single, which would have been a boundary. In fact, done well is just two. 
And that boundary will bring South Africa's highest score against Pakistan. Previous was 265. Slow, low, full toss and beats the inner circle. A lot of run in the chase, Ali Riaz. As the batters turn around for the second and can get the third on the throw, but... Will uh, hit it and there's a chance of it uh, going uh, over the boundary. This one uh, goes over the boundary. Every ball has got to go. Oh, this one's played really nicely over the 45 for uh, four runs. Uh, great thinking, great result. That's a good ball in the block hole. Still a single there. Oh, that's nicely done. Bowling it full and wide outside the off. That's a great over there. She's given five in the last over and 292 is what South Africa women get in their lotted 50 for four. You've got to give it to Cap and Sunelis for their hundreds, which has been the core.